Will the Edmonton Oilers finally win a hockey game in this 2024-2025 NHL season? Or will the Philadelphia Flyers keep give them the fourth loss to start the season? Don Buster here, and we have a breakdown of this Philadelphia-Edmonton game coming right up. Just want to let everybody know we'll be doing free play videos, so you want to subscribe to Wager Talk TV. Give us a follow at Don underscore Buster, and make sure you hit the like button on these videos as it would be much appreciated. Uh, right now on the Wager Talk live odds page, which you can find on wagertalk.com, we have Edmonton as a 230 favorite with a total of six and a half. Now, this will be the Flyers' third game of a four-game road trip, and they are 1-1 one one so far. They've been playing pretty decent hockey, so the Flyers could be a, a live dog here, especially the way Edmonton has been playing so far to start the season. Uh, just haven't been playing that well at all. However, in saying that, this will be the Oilers' fourth home game. They've lost the first three, but I think, Believe it could be Philadelphia could be a team that could help Edmonton here at least get that offense going because their offense has been terrible. But again, I do not want really any part of this game, especially laying Edmonton at 230. That's just crazy. Crazy. I know people will say, well, Buster, you know what? Edmonton can't lose four games in a row at home. Well, yeah, they can. People are probably saying they couldn't lose two games in a row at home and then three games. So, yes, it's the NHL. It's early in the season. Upsets are happening all the time. Just ask Colorado last night as they got hammered at to lose their third straight game. So, again, another reason we're going to stay off this game, off the side here, is that this will be Edmonton's third game in four nights, that dreaded spot that we usually would go against or at least – Take a pass on it for sure. So the, definitely not betting the side here. However, we do like the total. We'll take the total over in this one. Uh, just saying this, I I can't believe I'm I'm saying it. This is like a statement that to me is like you know what? It's almost hard and possible to believe. Edmonton has only scored three goals in three games so far this season. Edmonton. That's. Sometimes they get three power play goals in a game. Uh, and talk about that. Here's something really strange as well. They have had only five power play opportunities all year, and they've scored once. The best power play by far last year, they've scored once all year. I think that changes tonight. I think they get a lot more opportunities. And th since this is be their last home game, they need to put on a good offensive show. And I think that's what you'll see out of the Oilers tonight. They'll put on a good offensive show. Uh, they'll score some goals. I even kind of like the over three and a half for Edmonton team total. But here's the problem with why I'm not taking Edmonton as, as a side. Because Philadelphia will get their goals. Edmonton has been terrible on defense, but maybe even more terrible in the net. They've allowed five goals a game so far to start the season. And just an example, last night with Colorado, they've struggled on the defensive end, allowing all kinds of goals. Well, nothing changed last night for Colorado. They allowed six more goals last night, and I see Edmonton allowing some goals here. So for me, the way to go is on the over in this game between Philadelphia and Edmonton. Now today, over at wagertalk.com, it's $5 Tuesday, and you can get all kinds of cappers packages even 5% plays for today only for $5. So you want to head over to the site and check that out. And when you do, go to my page at Don Buster, and we have our 4% NHL best bet up for tonight. And you can go to the site and get that package for only $5. Uh, let us know what you guys are betting. It's a big slate of NHL games tonight. Drop in the comment section. We appreciate all the comments. I try to get back to anybody that asks me questions. And uh, tell us what you like tonight. Uh, let, let us know uh, who you think the best play is for the night. Make sure that you subscribe to Wager Talk TV. There's lots of great content that Wager Talk puts out every day on Wager Talk TV. 
Give us a like. Give us a uh, follow at Don underscore Buster on the X, as they call it now. And best of luck with all your plays, everyone, today. And have a great day.